This post outlines the preparation phase for the conversation for action. The conversation for action has two roles, the customer or requester and the provider or promiser. The conversation starts with the person making the request. This is a fundamental speech act supporting the coordination of action between people. Speaking about requests, are you dealing with an inability to make effective requests? When you make a request, are you disappointed that the results did not meet your expectations? Are you uncomfortable about making requests? Does the level of discomfort rise to the point of avoiding or delaying requests? Before dealing with these issues, let's start with a key question. What starts the request process? The conversation starts when the customer recognizes that there is something missing and then makes a request to deal with what is missing. I tell my clients that life begins with a request. Now why do I say that? I have seen too many people that want certain results and are not willing to make the powerful requests required to produce the results they want. Rather than asking for what they want by making a request, they live in a world of expectation, hoping that someone will be a mind reader and fulfill the requests they were not willing to make. And when expectations are not fulfilled, they are very likely to live in a world of resentment. I have seen others that make requests, but they are not big enough to create the future they want to create. Finally, there are people that are not skilled in the art of making requests with clear conditions of satisfaction. In all these examples, there is suffering and or ineffective coordination of action between team members. I say life begins with a request because when you make a request, you move from the invisible world of expectations and hope to the visible world where someone has to deal with you they have to deal with your request. The moment you make a request, possibilities come into existence. These possibilities open up a new future, a future that would not likely happen without making the request to change your default future. Everyone has the right to make requests, and failure to exercise this right typically results in a loss of dignity and self-esteem. Now the preparation phase ends with a customer making a request and specifying the conditions of satisfaction to the provider. If you want to learn more about making effective requests and improving your ability to coordinate action, please reach out to me at 858-774-6041 or email me at rcepel at strategic-momentum.com. I look forward to speaking with you.